hi friends so in today's video i have a very exciting unboxing uh, it's this big box from five below um obviously i already know what's in it but i'm very excited about what's in it so i thought i would show you guys i ordered some squishmallows and a couple of other things um i've never ordered from five below like online before i would just go into the store and get my squishmallows and stuff but they had my store kept saying that they like online it kept saying that they had the squishmallows i wanted and then when i would go in they wouldn't have them and i really wanted the like latest like new og drop um that had Waxy in it and Waxy's is my favorite she has a little like shrine over here on this table um that's like in the background of my stream setup love her adore her and when i saw that five below had her i had to get her even though i already have a few <laughs> um but when my store kept saying that they had them online every time i would go in she would be gone so i was like well i'll just order it online because i'll die if i can't have her and so i ordered it online and i had to order a few other things that justify the eight dollar shipping cost just a like a little word of advice you cannot get free shipping on five below no matter how much money you spend so I had to get some extra stuff to justify the $8 because I was not happy about it. So, yeah, I'm going to open this box for you guys. I hope you enjoy it. I'm super excited. Okay, so I kind of just pre-cut the box so that I wouldn't have to struggle to open it on camera. Um, but I haven't looked in it. I, I mean, obviously I know what's in there, but I haven't taken anything out yet. So let's go through it together. Um, I think... I'm gonna get the non squishmallow stuff first. So, first thing I have is this Pokemon blanket that I got off of Five Below. Um, so, I am a special education teacher and I have a lot of like blankets in my room for when the kids like lay on the bean bags and stuff. And I usually like rotate them with the seasons. And obviously, right now it's not really like a holiday or anything coming up. And so, I bought this pink um pokemon blanket because i thought it was so stinking cute look at them are you kidding they're super cute it says um pokemon days and it has a bunch of little pokemon on it i thought it would be super cute i have a lot of like pink and like blue and green and stuff in my room so i thought it would match and i have a few kids who like pokemon so i thought this would be so cute i love it i kind of want to steal it <laughs> but i do not need any more blankets okay and then next this i'm so excited about it's also for my classroom um i think i'm gonna put it at like our like exit door like the door that goes outside because we don't really use that door very often um and so i won't have to worry about it getting too trampled on but it's this little turtle rug look at him i thought that was so cute and so yeah i'm gonna put him at, like the back door of my classroom he's it's super soft um and it has these little like tassels on the end and it looks like it has an egg on its back i don't really understand why but it's cute anyways look at his little look at his little face i'm super excited to take it in there i think it's gonna look so, super cute and i have a bunch of like little animal lovers in my room i'm excited okay now the rest is plushies um i have well i have a little bomb bum in here um, let me grab, so my shelf that has all my bum bums on it was back here, this little like leg area, but it fell and I'm waiting for new like tape, the like mounting kind of stuff to put it back up. So they're not up there right now, but let me grab, I still just have them sitting back here. Look at how stinking cute, look how stinking cute this little flower is with this little watering can. But this is the one that I just got. I got this one from Five Below as well. I think. <laughs> Don't quote me on that one. But I'm pretty sure I got this one at Five Below. I know they have a big version of this one at Walgreens, though. I saw it the other day. Um, but here's this little flower. She's Her little, like, petals are super duper soft. And I've gotten into Bumbums recently, which is very dangerous. Because my Squishmallow addiction is a little out of hand i shouldn't really have another one but they're just so cute and i couldn't help it so we have another addiction now i have a couple other bum bums um that are behind me where their shelf fell but yeah another addiction is in the it's like starting phase and i'm 
a little worried, but whatever. Okay, and now the stars of the show. The Squishmallows. So I have... Wait, did I, like, miscount? I swear... There's definitely one missing. Wait, did it, like, fall or something? Oh, it did. Okay, I was like, uh... Anyways... So I have... The first one... Is this little Loch Ness monster. His name is... I might be saying it wrong, but it's a loon. Um, I have them... No, I have them in clip form. Oh my god, if I can move the hand right the right way. Right... Over there, right... <laughs> Um, but yeah, I have a little clip of him that I got um, at Walmart, which all of my Switch dolls that I bought in like last month will be in my video. They post next week. Um, I post monthly about all the Switch fellows and like other plushies that I bought in the span of the last month. And so I'll have a new one of those next week and I'll have all those ones in there. But Walmart hopped the heck off with the Switch fellows for summer and I got a lot of them. So those will all be in my next video. But I got this seven and a half inch version of loon who i have the little clip of i love the loch ness monster posters i have artin right here <laughs> um they're my favorite well they're my favorite but they're up there i think they're super cute artin is definitely my favorite loch ness monster i love how pink she is and i hope we see more of her soon where she was like um a first release for valentine's day this year but i hope we see more of her because i do absolutely adore her yeah this is loon um, he has a little ribbed, soft belly, and his little blushing cheeks. And then he has little spots on his head, and the spine down his back. And then here's his tag. You can pause if you want to read his little bio. I don't know how readable it'll be. Okay, and then I have this little guy who is past Easter. <laughs> Easter was like almost a month ago now but I could not find Luann for the life of me at Five Below. Um, my store every time I would go never had it in stock and it was so sad because she is so cute and I love her little curl hat and I could never ever ever find her. So this is a little late Easter haul I guess <laughs> for Luann. She's just this cute little possum in a little carrot hat. She's so precious. And I'm so happy that I finally got her because I was a little bit heartbroken when Easter passed when I didn't get her. So I guess it's perfect that I had to place this five below order. Um, but yeah, she has this little tail. I love the possums. I don't know if you can see him, but I have a possum. I think he's too far down there. But I have the Valentine's Day possum, uh, Chambles, the heart glasses. I love him. Uh, but yeah, she's so cute. Oh, and here's her tag. Like I said, she is an Easter squish or she has an Easter squish. Easter tag. But I'm very happy that I finally got her. Try to make it as readable as I can. <laughs> okay, and then we have the stars of the show, plus a little extra. We have the Bigfoots. I'm a Bigfoot girly. The Bigfoots are my favorite. You can see my little Shasta. Oh my god, if I could learn how to like point on camera. We have this little Shasta. I have two. Okay. Actually, I'll get to that in a second. But first, we have Diane, who is so cute. I cannot believe that this is my first Diane. I don't know how I've never gotten her before. I don't know what kind of glitch in the Matrix that there was that she has never lived with me and lived on my bed. But I finally got her. Um, I'm a Bigfoot enjoyer. I have a couple of Brinas, a few Waxies. And now I'm adding Dylan. Oh, and Shasta, and a lot. Oh, Danny's over there. A ton, a ton um, of Bigfoots. And now I'm adding Diana to my collection. She's so cute. Um, she's pink and she has a little white belly. And look at her little toes. And she has um, yellow, blue, pink, purpley kind of hair. I love her. I'm a little sad I didn't get her sooner because she's adorable. And I'm going to have to start searching for her on sell in trade groups and on Mercari because I need, I need more. I need more of her. She is so stinking precious. And here's her tag. I'm pretty sure she's, actually I know she is in this new OG drop that I blow it out with Waxy. 
Um, but she's so cute. She graduated college. And what, what else? She's put in a few re- office resumes. She's, she's, a, she's a professional girly. Play. Love her. Diane. Okay, and now for my favorite Squishmallow. Let me actually... I hope this doesn't like mess with the whole thing. I'm going to pay you guys over to see my other two oxies. So you can kind of see, ignore the mess of my table. Don't look at it too close. But you can see I have a 16 inch boxy and then I have a seven and a half inch boxy. And then now I have another one. I should, I should like compare all the boxies. Oh my God. Now you're a little too close. Hold on. Um, I don't know where you were. Anyways, <laughs> this is the five below new OG Waxy. My girl. She's just like this super cute hot pink and purple and I love her. I love her little teeth. Um, and here's her little purple toes. Oh my god, I love her, I love her. Well, I guess maybe let's compare all the waxies because they do all look like very different. Um, which is something I started to learn as I started to get like multiple of my favorite squishmallows, which is something I had done in the past. Um, they vary quite a bit based on like their size and who sold them and yada 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 so this is actually okay this is the 8 inch and then this is the 7.5 inch so I have a 7.5 inch and 8 inch and then I have the big girly over there who I believe is a 16 inch she might be 14 inch though I don't know for sure but this Waxy is from Walgreens um, she's part of their summer drop and this is the 5 below Waxy you can see that they look like super different i mean i guess it's not like that dressing maybe i'm a little bit dramatic but they do look different um the colors on their hair and stuff and i mean the pinks are pretty similar but their face quality also like their their blush i guess is what it is that's making such a big difference but their faces look different um this one has a lot more fur this one has a lot less but yeah you can just kind of see that they're different and i'll put this eight inch waxy away i am not super happy with the quality i think her hair looks a little patchy the walgreens version did not impress me but i got it anyways because i love waxy no matter how she looks and then i have my big girl um i believe that this is a 16 inch waxy but she looks amazing i love her so much and this is her next to the seven and a half inch waxy from five below again you can just tell that like this one i got this one from amazon a while back you can just kind of tell that compared to the five below version and the walgreens version that she just this one just has it going on she she really popped off she really got herself together she's adorable the purples aren't as drastic her hair looks a lot better um but i mean other, otherwise she's pretty similar i think you can see that the shades of pink are a little different on both of these. She's not as hot of a pink. But yeah. I'm a Waxy enthusiast and thought I would show you guys the difference between all of my Waxies because it is like the slightest bit upsetting, but I love her anyways. Okay, and then lastly, I have... Oh my god. You didn't see it, but all of those Waxies just fell. I'll have to pick them up later. I have a Mystery Squad. Um, this is the dessert ones i will say i have bought a pack of these i believe it was at walgreens and i got i think this is it's either dibs or diddy but um she she is in my donate slash sell pile don't hate me if i get another one of her i think i'll cry a little bit inside um, I thought we could open it together. I love opening the mystery squads. It's like my guilty pleasure. Um, I think they're super fun. And I love them. And oh my god. I saw the other day at American School. They had the one, the toy drops. Which was like the ones that had Naomi, the banana Bigfoot. All of those like food crossovers. They had mystery squads of them. And I was gonna buy one but they were like 18 dollars and i'm kind of hoping that those toy drop squishmallows release elsewhere because i did not get them the got shop confused me and i did not get them and i cried <laughs> well okay well i 
maybe I did a little bit, <laughs> but I wanted Naomi so stinking bad. Sorry, I am irresponsible and my phone is out of storage, so I had to go make some. Anyways, I was saying that I wanted Naomi so bad and I was heartbroken that I didn't get her. And I I love the food crossovers. I have um, the previous like food crossover squad, which had like the strawberry cat. Um, it had pierogi, Fatima, and yeah, I just wanted Naomi so bad. She was so cute, she, and I cried a little bit inside when I didn't have her. But I saw American Eagle had them for like eighteen dollars, and like the Mystery Squads, um, which was super exciting, and I wanted it so bad. And then I saw that it was like eighteen dollars. I was like, that's a little much for a four point five inch squishmallow. That might not even be the one I want. So I'm hoping that they release those toy drops um squish somewhere else i've heard that they do i've never bought any from them before um but i've heard that they do typically end up in like clairs and stuff so i'm manifesting i need to check honestly i haven't checked in a while i need to check and see if they've come out anywhere else but i'm like fingers crossed that i can get no home because if i don't i think i'll die um because i love i love the food crossovers and look i have pierogi and they would be besties i love i love the food crossover ones i think they're so cute anyways and get to the to the point of what I was trying to say earlier before I went on my sh spiel about Naomi. Um, I'm gonna open this Squishmallow Mystery Squad of the desserts. I'm hoping. I hope it's not this one again because she's sitting in my like not on my bed pile, which I don't want to say it in front of her, but you you know what that means. Uh, <laughs> so I'm I would really want the little like cookie cake the, like cookie ice cream sandwich gal i also love this one and this one oh, i think really the only two i don't want is the little cupcake and the little like key lime pie um which i don't feel anything on the forehead so i'm hopeful let's see oh my god i'm not strong wait haha <laughs> Okay, let's see who's in here. Okay, I got a peek. Oh, and these are the scented ones, too. I forgot. She's here. Oh, my God. And she smells so good. This Squishmallow is actually on my um, In Search Of list on the Squad app. So, here she is. I don't have to search for her anymore. I would like a bigger version. I don't even... I'll be honest. I don't even know if a bigger version exists. Um, But this is Coco. I love her little bow and her little, I don't know. I just think she's so cute. I've been wanting this Squishmallow for a while. She um, is on my squad app and now I'll get to add her to my collection, which speaking of that, I might make a video of me going through all my Squishmallows and adding them on there because I'm a slacker and I got lazy and didn't use the squad app for way too long. And now a majority of the Squishmallows on here are not on there and I need to put them on there. I want to be a good collector um, that I've been neglectful <laughs> so I'm gonna maybe make a video doing all of that and then kind of like going through all the squishmallows I have like just kind of scrolling through and then going through my in search of and my like in des uh, desperately in search of list um, because I need to do it anyways and maybe someone else will enjoy it maybe someone will relate to the fact that I am a slacker um, but yeah anyways <laughs> This is Coco and her little pink bow and her smile. Here is her tag. I'm glad to have finally found her. She's super cute. And that is everything from Five Below. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this scatterbrained Five Below haul that I just gave you. Um, I had a lot of fun. Uh, it was interesting to see a new Waxy. I love her. And um, I really like all the Squishmallows I got. I'm excited to add more Dianes to my collection. Um, yeah, and I like my rug and my blanket. And I'm so happy that I got Coco out of that mystery bag. I hope you guys like watching. And like I said earlier in my video, I do have a video coming out next week that has all of the Squishmallows and like other plushies that I bought within the last month. And these will be in there, but I'll kind of mention them briefly since I'm talking about them here. Um, and if you like Squishmallow content, I am your girly. Um, I post primarily Squishmallow content as well as gaming content on my channel. So if you're a Squishmallow gamer girl, come to me.
Um, I could definitely use more like mutuals and stuff for Squish Mellow Gamer Girlies. Um, but you can check out my previous videos, like all the plushies that I bought in March. March? March. It is April. All the ones that I bought in March. And I have other videos like a Valentine's Day haul. I have a video reorganizing all of my Squishmallows. Um, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoy and I hope to see you all again. Bye! Thank you.